Most AI image generators don't support uncensored images, even if you're on a paid plan. But what if I told you there's a way around that? Yes, you heard me right. Let's talk about one of the most popular AI image generators, DALI. Now, if you try to give it a prompt to generate uncensored images, it just won't do it. Let's try it out right now. Yep, no results. But hang on. We're not even talking about anything unsafe here, just uncensored content. Even generating images of celebrities or any well-known public figures is near impossible, even with paid versions. I've tested this on several platforms like Midjourney and Bing, and guess what? The results were exactly the same. No support. So what's the solution? Are we stuck with these limitations forever? Absolutely not, because today, in this video, we're diving into one of the most powerful tools recently launched, and trust me, it's a game changer. Introducing Flux. And here's the best part. While it's a paid tool, I'm about to show you how you can use it for free. There's been a ton of buzz in the online community and the reviews are glowing. Many are saying that Flux is even better than Midjourney and Dolly 3 especially when it comes to generating uncensored images or even NSFW content. Flux is a product of Black Forest Labs, and they've released three versions of it. Flux Pro, Flux Schnell, Flux Dev. Now Schnell and Dev are free to use, but the real powerhouse is Flux Pro. But stick around because I'm gonna show you how you can access Flux Pro for free and generate unlimited images. Before we dive into the steps, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on more killer tools like this. Now let's get into the two methods you can use to access Flux Pro for free. Method one, using the Glyph app first up, we have the Glyph app, a tool builder that lets you create any kind of tool you want. It's simple, just drag and drop elements to create your own tool. And guess what? I've already built Flux Pro on Glyph. So you don't need to create it from scratch unless you want to. If you do, the tutorial is available on my channel. But if you want to save time, you can use my tool and the link is in the description. Now once you've got the app open, you'll see a prompt box. This is where the magic happens. I've already included a prompt enhancer, which will automatically level up any prompt you put in. Let's test it out with a prompt that didn't work on DAL E3. Here goes. Donald Trump hugging Kamala Harris in the White House. And there it is. Did you see that? The very same thing Dolly refused to generate, Flux did in seconds. That's the power of this tool. Method two, using Tensor Art. Next up, we've got the Tensor Art app, which is another super fun and fascinating platform. Tensor Art isn't just an image generator, it's a whole hub of creative tools where you can build almost anything you can think of. Now, I'll admit, Tensor Art can be a bit tricky to learn at first, but once you've got the hang of it, Believe me, it's absolutely worth it. Start by searching for TensorArt on Google and creating a free account. Once you're in, you'll see a ton of apps available. But for generating uncensored images, we're going to use a specific one. Just input your prompt. Let's try the same one. Donald Trump hugging Kamala Harris in the White House. Now here's the one downside to TensorArt. It takes a little longer to process than Glyph. But trust me, this wait is 100% worth it. And there it is, boom! You can simply save the image and use it wherever you want. If this video helped you discover something new, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon so you can stay up to date with all the latest and greatest tools in the AI world. I've got more exciting tutorials coming your way, so stay tuned. Thanks for watching.